If you want to start making ad creatives for your marketing agency coaching program, but you don't want to work with an agency, you don't want to hit up editors, you don't want to figure out how to script this yourself, don't worry, I got you covered. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use AI to edit your short form video ad creatives super quickly. And then next, I'm going to give you ad creatives that literally crush for marketing agencies and online coaches. I know people who use these same ad creative templates and editing styles, and they go ahead and generate 100K a month, 200K a month, even up to a mil a month using this ad creative script template. So without further ado, let's get right into it. So first, we're going to start off with how to edit your ad creatives in seconds using AI. And then after that, we'll transition into how to script out your ad creatives. And I have two templates that you guys can copy paste. So Submagic is going to be linked in the description. So what you want to do is go to Submagic, make a free account. They have a free trial. And then after that, you're going to go into projects and then you're going to hit new video. And then you're going to upload your video. So I'm just going to drag and drop my raw footage into here. Super simple. Let it load for a second. And then you're going to hit upload. So once your video is loaded in, it's going to look like this. You can pick out your caption style, whether it's Hormozy 1, Devin, Ella, doesn't matter. I'm personally going to pick Luke. I think it's super clean. And then you're going to be able to edit the theme. You can change the color. You can change the size. You can change the position. So right now my captions aren't popping up just because I have to change my timestamp. But you can change your second color so that, you know, maybe you don't want to highlight anything. You can just change it all white. Maybe you do like those highlights. So I personally just remove them. I don't think they're, they're necessary. I'm literally just going to make everything white. And then after that, you can change your caption size. You can make them bigger. You can make them smaller. Obviously, if you make them too big, you know, it's going to go two lines. So just do something like that. It just has to be legible. And then for your position, try and just move it like around here. You want to try and keep it in the square one by one for ad creatives, just in case you end up cropping them into four by three or one by one. Next, you're going to hit captions. So here you can edit the captions. You can go through, edit the captions, look for typos. The AI is super, super good at picking stuff up. This is why it's super quick compared to other softwares, but you can just go through. So if you want to start working with high ticket clients that actually value what you do, blah, blah, blah. I'm just looking through trying to see if there's any spelling mistakes. To be honest, it looks good so far. So one thing I noticed is that I said the same line multiple times. So I'm just going to go through and delete them. So I'm just going to click here, delete, delete, delete until I reach the point where I've deleted everything. Boom. Now that we've deleted everything, I'm going to go through. Everything looks good. Once I have my video done, I'm going to go on to the next step, which is B-rolls. Honestly, guys, for ad creatives, I would avoid using B-rolls. It's not really too necessary. And overall, it can just hurt the ad creator's performance. Just keep it super, super simple. But, you know, hey, if you're ever editing a, a video for your Instagram Reels or YouTube Shorts, you know, you want to add some B-rolls, you do it through here. And the next step, you're going to go to the boost section. So hook titles are super, super good for your Instagram organic content, I would personally just not use it for ad creatives, but I'm just going to show you guys how to do it anyways. It's going to go ahead and generate a hook title. And then I'm going to go to the start of the video so we can see it. And then you can edit the text right here. You can even change the font. I think the default font mic is super, super good. And the size is good as well. You want to just move this to the top or somewhere right below your chin level. And guys, just keep in mind while you're recording, try and line yourself up like I did in this video. I'm actually slightly low. If you can bring your eyes slightly higher, it would be better. And then I'm going to go on to the next step and make sure you're saving throughout just in case your laptop dies or your electricity goes out or anything like that. So you're going to want to hit save. And then after that, you're going to go ahead and export your video. I'm going to go here, quality standard. I'm going to go with 1080p because I know that's what I recorded in. And that's pretty much all you need for ad creatives. And then for FPS, I'm going to go with 60 and I'm going to hit export. So now it's just exporting my video. We'll give it a second. So once again, guys, Submagic is going to be linked in the description. So now I have the project exported. So I just have to hit download video and then it's going to head and be downloaded. So now I can go into the ads manager, launch this ad and we'll be ready to roll. So that's how you edit your ad creatives using AI. You see, that was so much quicker than if I opened Premiere Pro, did it manually, did all the cuts, et cetera, et cetera. This way I could literally go in and just edit the cuts using the captions. So whenever I saw I messed up, I just deleted it and then it split the clip, removed that part. I didn't have to do any clipping, remove the dead space. It was just so, so simple. All right, so now let's get into how to script out your ad creative. So this is gonna be template number one. You've probably seen this type of template multiple times and it's because it works, right? It's been working for multiple years and it's gonna keep working as far as I know, but only time will tell. So you're gonna say, quick question for niche over dollars per month. Also heads up guys, I did not make this first template. This is from Kybax. So this first part here, you're essentially calling out the audience. You're gonna say agency owners over 25K a month. If I told you in the next 90 days, we'll guarantee to generate you an additional 10 to 30 qualified calls every single month or you won't pay a single cent. Would you take me up on that? Now, if you're wondering, why I'm putting my neck on the line with such a bold claim. Here's why it's because of our proven track record. Daniel Fazio added an additional 108K in cash collected in 82 days. Eddie Cumberbatch scaled from 54K a month to over 430K a month working with us in five months, so on and so forth. You throw in all your social proof there. And then for the CTA, you're going to say, so if you want to get XYZ result, just click the button below, fill out your information and book a call. Super, super simple. So this one is simple. It works. A lot of people say, oh, it's tiring. You know, like people have seen this ad so many times. It doesn't work, but it still works. And then for template number two, 
too. So this is for follower ads. I'm currently running this funnel. So this is super good for online coaches. I haven't seen it really work too well yet for any done for you sort of people. It's more for coaches from what I've seen. Let's say I'm coaching dropshippers. So I'm gonna say dropshippers. Are you struggling with limited supply, not being able to get enough sales or maybe building your store, whatever those pain points are? Well, Johnny implemented my three to one dropshipping method and got from point A to point B in time frame. And you add another case study and you say, if you wanna learn more about how you can implement the same system they did, drop me a follow here on Instagram. And then the whole point of the funnel is you're gonna have a setter message everybody who follows your account. And that's how the funnel works. You qualify them in the DMs and you book a call. So this works super, super well. People have scaled with this. The problem with these follower ads, also known as profile visit ads, you can't really track the cost per call properly because you won't know which people came from which ad. You won't know if the people came from organic or if it was ads, but it works. All I know is you put money in, you get money out. So it works. And then for this one, you're going to do this through the ads manager, a lot more traditional. You're going to run a VSL book a call funnel. So you're going to be able to track the cost per call. You know, if you're targeting like marketing agencies, online coaches, like 200 to 300 bucks per qualified show call, that's a good number. That's how to script out your ad creatives. Usually you want to launch this type of thing with five hooks and one body. And then for this one, you'll usually get a couple of them taken down because Facebook is slightly mean these days. However, you'll definitely get a couple that won't be rejected and you should be ready to roll. So that's it for this video. If you want to edit your ad creatives using AI in seconds, that's going to be linked in the description. And also if you need somebody to help script out, edit, and produce your ad creatives for you, just hit the first link in the description, which is going to be tickscale.net. That's a link to work with my done for you agency. We also do YouTube videos, Instagram, reels, you name it. If you found this video useful, you'll probably find a couple other ones on my channel useful. Check them out and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.